As more executives are calling their employees back into the office, workers are struggling to find a style, both work appropriate and also summer casual. So some are opting for shorts in this brutally hot times. Dave, I have a feeling you're a fan of this. I'm pretty sure you actually wore shorts to the office last week. So what do you think? <laughs> Well, yes, I did wear shorts just uh, about a week ago, but I think that was the day that it was like 96 Ew. degrees okay. uh, with humidity. Quite frankly, I'm wearing the Zoom tuxedo right now. No one needs to see it, but the shorts and the flip-flops are down below. I actually am not a huge fan of this. I think under certain occasions, the boss isn't willing to look the other way. If it is 94, 95 and humid, have a little flexibility. You're seeing it a lot in Silicon Valley, but I think generally, as a rule, I would surprisingly say I'm not a big fan, Rochelle. And I too have on shorts and flip flops <laughs> with, with my blazer. You guys are rubbing it in. I'm the only one in studio today. <laughs> I wish I had shorts and flip flops on. I'm here in heels. But, but you know what? I will say if I was in the office, I would not be rocking the shorts. But I, I think, you know, there has to be some sort of there has to be some sort of guidelines around it. Like that has to at least pass the fingertip t test. Like if you put your arms straight down and your shorts are shorter than your fingertips, it's a bit too short. Maybe you don't need to wear that to the office. If they're, if they're dressy enough, yeah, maybe. I mean, maybe you could make it look like you're not really taking your job too seriously. So, eh, I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of this one. I just think that, one, I don't think it, most of them would be appropriate. And two, I'm always freezing. So I would always love to have pants on rather than shorts, but that's just my opinion. I just think it, one last thing on it. I think some <laughs> employers are just having to offer yeah. things like this. It's such a hard labor market, in particular with younger workers that want to work from home. It's such a difficult labor market right now. Some employers have no choice but to offer things like this. So whether we like it or not, I think it's going to continue to evolve in that direction.